peace with God reading from scripture Romans chapter 5 verse 1 therefore having been justified by faith we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ Colossians chapter 1 verses 19 and 20 for it pleased the father that in him all the fullness should dwell and by him to reconcile all things to himself by him whether things on earth or things in heaven having made peace through the blood of his cross all of man in its carnal or fleshly state lack peace with God we all come into the world fighting against God because we are part of the rebellion that started with Adam and Eve we fought against God and everything we did were against his principles the Bible states that we were once alienated and enemies in our minds by wicked works there was no peace because of our alienation with God sinful and wicked people cannot come into the presence of a holy God something must make us who are unholy righteous before we can be at peace with God and that's exactly what Christ did dying for our sin imputing his righteousness to sinners we then belong to his side and the enmity ends we came over to his side and the hostility ended so how do we have peace with him it is only through reconciliation so when we receive Jesus Christ we are no longer enemies but we are at peace because we are reconciled Jesus reconciled us to him by shedding his blood on the cross this treaty that he made by shedding blood on the cross gave us a covenant of peace that declares that those who believe in peace believe in him are at peace with him so through Jesus we receive the reconciliation and thereby have peace with God and are blameless and without reproach every believer has peace with God so because of this because of the reconciliation we can rest in the solid fact that we have peace with God we do not have to fear what the world throws at us or the temptations that we have or what the enemy does to us because God has purchased for us uh, our salvation there is nothing in the way of his very presence in our lives peace with God however is dependent upon faith and our choice to receive that gift of salvation peace with God describes the state between God and the believer so only when we decide when we believe when we have faith in Jesus Christ are we reconciled and do we have peace with God this is a fact outside of ourselves and every believer is at peace with God because of the blood of Jesus so as a child of God you don't have to worry about losing your peace because it was not on your own efforts it was because of the gift that Jesus gave us through his salvation it was only through Christ that the reconciliation came and through this we are conscious about the peace with God which means that we no longer have to face that fear of condemnation through Jesus we have peace with God forever this is an ex external and an eternal reality that will never change let's pray together father God we thank you for the peace that we have with you once we have believed in you Lord once we have trusted you father you have given us that peace with you something that not, that de the devil or our circumstances can never take away we thank you for the gift of salvation and for reconciling us back to yourself so that we could be friends in Jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk please visit apcwo.org